Hi. Welcome to ERP Next Tutorials. ERP Next has many documents which can be submitted. Once submitted, all the fields of that documents are frozen, hence you cannot further edit it. To be able to edit any submitted document, you should first cancel, and then amend it. Let's open a submitted purchase order, and amend it. Since this transaction is submitted, the fields are frozen, and not editable. Let's assume that we need to select another supplier in this purchase order. To be able to amend it, you should first cancel this purchase order. Once a document is cancelled, you will find a button to amend it. Click Amend button to edit this purchase order. Now, you can see that all the fields in the purchase order are editable. Let's select another supplier. Save. You can observe that hyphen 1 has been added to the original purchase order ID. This indicates that this purchase order is an amended version of other purchase order. Each time a transaction is amended, the value in the purchase order ID will be added by 1. After submission, values in the fields will be frozen once again. Being a system manager, you will be able to control cancel and amend permission for the users. You can see that for the purchase user role, cancel and amend permission is not assigned. But purchase manager has cancel and amend permission assigned. As per this permission, only if a purchase manager role is assigned to the user, the purchase order will be editable after submission. Also, to be able to delete a submitted document, you should first cancel it. Hope you found this video tutorial useful. For more details and free sign up, check erpnext.com. Thanks for watching.